so I hit him like this. I can't get with that. I gotta keep it thick, never miss, so I hit him like this. Straight to the track, my lyrics is fat, I'm ripping the hell down. More than a flute, I'm regularly wrecking a joint, so what now? So many brothers be biting their tongue to tech two I B. Well, check out the J, check out the A, check out the Y, Z. Original rap, I'm making it slap. I'm hemming it up like that, stringing it, slinging, swinging it fat. Bring it back, I be that brother with a gap. Boom, clack. Don't ever sweat it when I go, I zoom back. Better than ever, never better, you better, whatever. I suggest some neck slacks and that'll get your shit together. I give you a snotty nose from body blows. Nobody safe at a party, he even gotta go. Adios, I got, got, got the, the, the flavor, so save yours. One verse and it's a hearse, I played it and I slayed yours. Get it, got it, ready to flip, I doubt it, no need to prolong. Check out the man gone, I'm out. I can't get with that. I gotta keep it thick, never miss, so I hit him like this. All right, all right, all right. We know that was some bad rapping. I was looking for that instrumental forever. It's called I Can't Get With That from Jay-Z. That was like 93, 1993, that's right, before some of you guys were even alive. That's when Jay-Z rapped fast, and he was at his all-time best, in my opinion, around that reasonable doubt in my lifetime era. Nonetheless, though, so hashtag nonetheless, I know I say that too many times. I'm Dream Killers representing Madden Mastermind. Hope everybody's doing well. Name of the, the name of the video is going to be called Mr. A Gap is Back because you guys are going to see here. I was labbing some hardcore last night. There's an A Gap. There's another one screaming. Look at Claiborne or Carr actually jumping out of nowhere. I was labbing last night. Found a little A Gapper that was working out pretty well for me. So I threw it at this guy plenty of times. You guys will see it in the game. Running with the Dallas Cowboys, the normal scenario, best team in the NFL once again. Definitely top five in Madden. I really don't even care about the NFL part of it, but I heard they got some upgrades today. I didn't even get a chance to go through and check them out. I'll probably get to that later tonight. And our opponent here is running with the New Orleans Saints. You can see minimal amount of time. We're already up 21 zip on this guy. We got a good little thing going lately. I think I'm like 21 game win streak. There's a little heater. And unfortunately, though, he completes the pass here. Actually gets on the board to avoid the goose egg. But it wouldn't have mattered anyway because you guys can see here. You know if I'm showing kickoffs, something horrendous or good is going to happen. So unfortunately, this time it's horrendous. Special teams looking terrible. So he gets on the board with a touchdown. So, you know, the game's somewhat in reach if he could step up and play some defense. But offense has been looking pretty, pretty good here lately. And I've been running it pretty like a well-oiled machine. Even Witten's getting big for us. And then Murray. He's going to finish it off, get the touchdown for us. So now we're back up 18, A gapper. Then we're sending some edge heat. But you're going to see here, pretty soon I think I send like five A gappers, four A gappers in a row. It just gets out of control. He didn't know what to do. There's one. Here comes two. That's how many actually got the pass off. Number three. And then we send number four. He actually gets off the sack here and then throws it, completes it, but just ends up a little bit short. So we're right back on offense. Middle amount of time left in the third. Just destroying this dude. I said, I've been doing pretty well lately. Uh, getting, you know what? I, I think I dropped again. I don't know. For some reason, I'm like 600, but I only got, you know, 30 games in or something. I don't know. Nonetheless, Des scores again. Another A gap or that one should have been yicked. Then we throw some pressure, get the user pick. Scandrick, man, one of the best Madden players in the game. Ends up returning it. This is where he quits out. So now we're going against the Philadelphia Eagles. This ought to be a good game in the NFL when it actually happens. And always, as always, running the blueprint defense under Bill Walsh, or under center Bill Walsh spread. And yes, for the guys asking, I am currently working on the ebook. I had to put it on hold for a little bit just because of some personal things that come up here and there. And then I had to do the update for the guide. I wasn't expecting the patch last week. So I wanted to get that done since it was already a working process. So nonetheless, there we go again with that stupid word. Um, <laughs> I'm going to try to get it done here. I'd say tomorrow's Friday. I'm going to try to get it done over the weekend. And we'll see how we come out with that. So sometime next week, though, for sure, 100%. No questions asked. I already got a lot of the basic stuff done. It's just a matter of recording uh, a few of the extra little formations that you guys see me mix in here and there in the videos. But, you know, I would run them more if I'm playing like a Mav or a Chappie, T-Raw or something like that. Just because everybody knows. I've been running spread for like the last three or four years. That was a good little user pick there. So they know, almost know what's coming. So I got to mix it up a little bit. The scheme still works, but, you know, you got to be able to mix it up and run something else other than the one formation. First, the better guys, I think. You, you'll see here as I'm sure I get in the top 100. I'm going to have to switch it up at least for a play here or there. Possibly, anyway. Unless my reads are still on or I'm doing a good job mixing up and not being stubborn. But anyway, you can see here we're off to a 7-0 lead. Got that 
good good pick on the first drive and now up 14 nothing with you know three minutes and 30 seconds left here in the first half i think i get the ball i don't even know who gets the ball coming out after half and this was this one was kind of scary here his man you know they got probably you know i'd say right behind demarco murray they got the probably the best running back combination or they definitely got the best running back combination in madden i would say pretty lethal i don't even think he used sproles though but i guess you don't really have to when you got mccoy and at least in madden you know i think he's a little bit better i don't know i know obviously sproles is agile and stuff but they make shady probably 90 i don't even know somebody let me know now in the comment section what his overall is i'm sure it's in the high 90s somewhere like around where murray's is like i think murray's like a 93 or something like that we expect it to be a little bit higher after the uh, update and there goes a little a gap that he just breaks off like it never happened and then he's rolling right back downfield. He had a good little scheme. He was mixing in runs, play action, the whole scenario. So that was kind of killing the A-gap for me, so I wasn't really running it. And I will add the – that was a huge fourth down stop for what it was worth. And then he picks it right back, though. I will add that A-gap here. I'm going to record that tonight, and you guys can add that into the mix for the Blueprint guys or Master members. Um, unfortunately, I literally just found it last night. And so I'll, I will put that in there. You guys will have it for the weekend. It's good to mix in, especially when the guys are heavily passing. That should have been yicked. But look at that, man. Even get them on the fourth down on it. So that was huge. And it'll come, you know, if they run play action, it should come off the edge. But anyways, it works pretty well. In that first game, you could definitely see it was looking pretty good. And then Witten, I throw it to him twice in a row, man. And neither time can he hang on to it. So whatever. So third and ten. We got to make it happen. Look at Cole Beasley, man. Looks like a fumble, but the man was down. So give me that ball back. And DeMarco's just running in the traffic. Still picks up five, his normal average. And then look at this, man. I'm just like congested here, running into my dudes. But Murray just runs, runs people over. So we continue on to the next play, Cole Beasley again. That's got to be like my money play, if I got any money play whatsoever. There's too many reads right there, specifically versus zone. And look at, I think this is Dunbar at this point. I made another mistake. I think uh, I said Dunbar was the one that had the huge game on Sunday, but he always has a huge game for me. But the marker came back in. He quit. That's it. Dream Killers for Madden Mastermind. I'm sorry about the rap earlier. I hope you guys enjoyed the video, though. Leave a like if you did, and we will catch you guys again tomorrow. Expect some new teams. We got New England Patriots up next.